Hi there, my name is Adnan and in this video I'll show you how to use the Blender integration of Quixel Bridge. This integration was made from the ground up for Blender 2.8 and is completely free and open source for you to use, tweak and share. To start off, I'll click on an asset that I want to export. I'll head over to the export settings in my site panel and then set my application to Blender. Once that's done, I'll click on download plugin and as soon as the plugin is downloaded, I'll just click on copy here, which will essentially copy this path to my script. Now back to Blender, I'll go to Edit, and then Preferences. In the Preferences window, I'll go to Add-ons, and then Install. Now I'll paste the path of my script, and then select this MS Live Link zip file. I'll click on Install Add-on from File, and then check my add-on. And that should be it. Now I can save my preferences and then close this window. To initialize the live link, you need to go to File and then Import. And now you have the Megascans live link option down below. I'll click on it once, and if we go back to Bridge and hit Export, our asset will automatically be imported in Blender. As you can see, the asset loads just fine with all the materials, geometry, and shader parameters. You can also import other assets like 3D plants for instance. Just click on the asset you want to export and if you don't want to head over to this panel every time to click on export, you can actually control click on this export icon over here and that'll send the geometry to Blender. So let's head over to Blender again and now we have our 3D plants. This integration gives you a fast way of prototyping with multiple assets and with the new real-time renderer EV in Blender, the possibilities become endless. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.